Do you want to buy the best players in FIFA 21 Ultimate Team? Well, if the answer is yes, don't buy FIFA points. Just head over to u7buy.com for your cheap, fast, safe, and reliable Ultimate Team coin. And during the team of the season period, u7buy have their biggest discount ever where you guys can save up to 15% off your order by using my code RRB at checkout. So, do you guys want me to build you your own personal squad builder? If the answer is yes, you're in the right place. If you want me to build you your own personal squad builder, all you guys have to do is simply follow a few quick and easy steps, all right? All you guys got to do is like this video, subscribe to the channel, and turn on post notifications, all right? And once you guys have done that, take a picture, screenshot that, head over to my Instagram, follow my Instagram, and then DM me that screenshot of you following the steps. And once you guys have done that, I can then build your squad, all right? It's that simple, it's that easy. And then, you can end up like these guys. Yo, 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 what's going on, people? Welcome back to another fantastic squad builder that we do have on the channel today for the team of the season period. I'm going to be showing you guys an overpowered 800k hybrid for you guys to use to destroy your opponents and achieve the highest possible rank in FIFA 21 foot champions. But before I do get into it, if you haven't seen the latest foot champions challenge I have done on the channel where I let an 83 plus times 25 pack pick my foot champions team, if you want to see that video, click the link down below in the description. I've also left um, links to other videos where I've done foot champions challenge challenges as well but yeah without further ado make sure you guys do smash a like on the video subscribe if you are new turn on post notifications and all that good stuff and we're gonna get straight into it let's get it let's go okay guys so as you can see right now on your screens for this 800k team the formation that you guys want to use is the 433 standard formation that is just simply to get everyone on full chemistry so at the end of the video i'm going to show you guys what formation to switch to in game but we're going to waste some more time we're going to get straight into it and we're going to start off with a bag in that striker spot a player that i do have in my club that i packed from i think it was i think it was a free pack you know i think it was a free pack i packed him in was it a free pack or or from my division rival uh, rank one rewards or something like that i don't know but the point is he's a first owner card a card that i've got in my club foot birthday and naki williams this guy is absolutely fantastic and i can tell you guys i've enjoyed every moment using this guy all the 82 games i've played with him have come from foot champions and division one um and yeah he's an absolute beast of a card i highly recommend that you guys go in and pick him up as you can see he's got five star skill moves four star weak foot he's really really pacey um he's got really Really good finishing amazing shot power as well um and his dribbling ball control and agility is decent as well but yeah i think anaki williams is a fantastic card and i think you guys will enjoy using him he's also a pretty strong striker as well as you guys can see there 89 strength so yeah make sure you guys do get anaki williams but to partner with anaki williams in the attack we do have another five star skiller uh he goes by the name of rian mares and it is indeed that new champions league card the 88 rated right winger champions league card make sure you guys do go ahead and pick up this rian mares card it is absolutely fantastic it really really is that is why i do recommend that you guys go ahead and pick it up um yeah he's got a lot of pace to him his finishing is fantastic but most importantly his dribbling like the dribbling side of morris's game is just fantastic 95 agility 91 balance uh 94 ball control 93 dribbling and 87 composure the guy is just absolutely fantastic and his finishing is good as well five star skill he's four star weak foot he has it all and that's why i think he's such a quality player for you guys to go ahead and uh, use because yeah man he's just he's almost the perfect right winger so make sure you guys do go ahead and pick up uh rian mares and then um in, in the left wing spot we do have just a normal standard goal Old card eden hazard all right he should get the job done very very nice um and i like him again same thing with mares where he's got really good dribbling stats you know his agility his balance his ball control um dribbling and composure is just fantastic so again that's another reason why i like hazard and that's another reason why i think that you guys should go ahead and uh, pick him up but yeah his finishing is quite good as well i really like finesse shots with eden hazard i think um finesse shots with eden hazard are very very effective in and around the penalty box but make sure you guys do go ahead and pick him up i think he'll do you a great job but with that being said we're going to move on into the uh three center mid spot so we're going to start off with the central center mid position where we do have another spanish player uh, another spanish liga player is indeed going to be in for marcus lorente okay make sure you guys do go ahead and pick this card up an amazing card a fantastic card a card that i recommend that you guys should pick up very very well rounded great defensively good going forward got a lot of pace as well for a center mid which is one of my favorite things about marcus lorente is that he's a center mid that is ridiculously fast um and he can like having that pace in the midfield really is a game changer because there aren't many midfielders like that um so yeah i just think that's a really really good actually 
to be about uh, Marcus Lorente. And of course, defensively, he is very, very solid as well. Um, and going forward, he can get the job done. So I think he's a good box to box card. And again, for that reason, I recommend that you guys do go ahead and uh, pick up Marcus Lorente. And then to partner up with Lorente in, uh, in, in what will be a, a CDM position. All right, guys, by the way, because like I said, uh, we're going to change formation in game. But yeah, in that left CDM spot, guys, we do have in from Frankie De Jong, uh, a more technical midfielder. Some of that on the ball is much better than someone like Lorente. You know, his agility, his balance, his, his dribbling, his ball control, his composure is absolutely fantastic. And that's why I like him a lot. Defensively, he's great as well. Got a decent amount of pace. He's got four-star skill moves. I really do like De Jong. I think he's a good link-up player to have in the midfield. And he's actually got good passing as well. So overall, Frankie De Jong, a great option. Make sure you guys do go ahead head and uh, pick him up and then in that right center mid spot guys uh who will be, this player will be playing cam uh he goes by the name of kevin de bruyne all right evan de oina kevin de bruyne however whatever you want to call him all right make sure you guys do go ahead and uh, pick him up he will be playing in that cam position in game the five star weak foot man himself all right a very very good card uh four star skill means five star weak foot yes he isn't pacey but he's going to be in the cam spot he doesn't really need to have like, a ridiculous amount of pace he is quick enough for that cam spot his passing is fantastic as we know already his long shots are amazing his shot power is amazing his dribbling is amazing so yeah a really good card make sure you guys do go ahead and pick up uh kevin de bruyne and uh yeah that does complete the midfield that does complete the attack we're going to go ahead and move on into the defense now we're going to start off with the right back spot and uh in this right back spot guys we do have another manchester city player uh, of course it's going to be kyle walker man make sure you guys do go ahead and pick up kyle walker uh a very solid right back option i think we all know that he should be able to get the job done it's that it's just that simple to be honest you know he's got the pace he's got the physicality um he's got all the attributes for it so I just think that he'll be able to do a great job. 94 sprint speed, 90 acceleration. Um, defensively, very, very solid. Like, he, he, we all know Kyle Walker's a very, very good card. So, make sure you guys do go ahead and pick him up. And the same goes for this left back here. Uh, Ferla Mendy from the La Liga. We all know, again, one of the most overpowered fullbacks in FIFA 21. Uh, just a fantastic card. Make sure you guys do go ahead and get him. I think, again, we all know that Mendy can do a fantastic job. So, there's no need for me to, you know, say much about this guy. We all know that he's fantastic. He's got four star skill moves five star weak foot he's pacey he's good defensively we already know man Furlan mendy gets the job done just go ahead and pick him up very cheap very affordable but most importantly very very effective and now we move ladies and gentlemen we move into the two center back positions so start off with the right center back spot we do have rafael varan all right make sure you guys do go ahead and pick up rafael varan um again just like Furlan mendy we all know that rafael varan is fantastic we already know that rafael varan is a game changer all right that's what he is He's a game changer. He's an overpowered meta card. Very, very cheap and affordable these days, but still the same old overpowered meta card that he was at the start of the game. So make sure you guys do go in and pick him up, man. As you can see, man, defensively, he's amazing. He's got a lot of pace as well. So yeah, he is just an amazing card. Again, I don't have to say too much about him. You guys already know that Rafael Varane is absolutely fantastic. And now to partner up with Rafael Varane, all right, in that center back spot, we do have uh, Champions League Diego Carlos. I can't remember what type of of Champions League card it is. I'm pretty sure it's a man. Of, I don't think it's a man of the match. It might be like a team of the team of the tournament, or team of the tournament, or team of the group stage, or a player of the group stage. I don't really know. There's quite a few var variations of the of the Champions League cards um, this FIFA, but it's going to be the 85 rated one. All right, and I think this card is fantastic. Okay, I really, really do like it a lot. Um, yeah, he's got he's got pace about him, and you know, defensively, he's really, really good. He's really, really strong. I like his body build, like the, the way his body is in game, like his body type in game. You know. He can really just um barge plays off the ball very very easily so strong um and yeah just a great defender him and Varane together are going to do an absolute job so yeah make sure you guys do go ahead and pick up those two and then to complete this 800k team in the goalkeeper spot again that strong link to Rafael Varane in goal we do have Thibaut Courtois so yeah make sure you guys do go ahead and pick up Thibaut all right the six foot seven man I do is he six foot seven I think he is he's six foot six right I, I, I was almost there um but yeah the six foot six man is absolutely fantastic get him all right he's a beast he should make a lot of saves and i really do like courtois in this game but yeah this is the team guys as you can see right now on your screens to get 100 chemistry all you guys got to do is convert lorente to a center mid and uh, obviously you're gonna need a uh, like a a manager as well from the premier league or the league it doesn't really matter um but more importantly the formation that you guys should be using in game okay the formation that you want to change to in game is actually going to be the 4-2-3-1 
uh, formation. Now, you guys want to do it like this. So, you want to have a Naki Williams in that striker spot. All right, you're going to want to have um, in the cam spot, Kevin De Bruyne. Then you're going to want to have De Jong and Laurentiis as the two CDMs and Hazard and Morris as the two wide men. It's that simple. It's that easy. Make sure you guys do switch to this in-game. And then, yeah, you're going to be just having an absolute laugh, right? You're going to be clapping your opponents. You're going to be destroying them. Honestly, it's going to be incredible. So, yeah, make sure you guys do something like this in-game. More importantly, let me know what you guys think of this team. Give it a rain out of 10 down below in the comment section as well. Um, if, if you have made it this far as well, hope you guys enjoyed the video. More importantly, check the link down below in the description. Check out my Foot Champions challenges on the channel, all right? They're much better videos to watch, in my opinion. So, make sure you guys do check those out. Make sure to smash a like on the video. Subscribe if you are new. Turn on post notifications. And until next time, guys, it's been your boy RB Plays. And I will see you later.